Once upon an evening dreary, the old duke stood weak and weary. Thank you, friends, for coming tonight. Now let us sit and dine. Tired now, he ends the lesson, pulls a polished Smith and Wesson, and ends it all on a question. I wonder, what's the time? But on the table, with a flurry, a guest lands in nick of time. The old clock struck half past nine. The bird was standing on newfound land, and from the grave there came a hand. Old Duke stood and eyed the pigeon that had halted his self-decline. Anger welled inside the aged, and pointing at the fowl he raged, Devilish pigeon with feathers faded, I shall crush you in good time. I shall shoot you, pluck you, cook you, my dear pigeon, all in good time. Both the pigeon, half past nine. The Duke pounced. Old man lively, but the pigeon sidestepped blithely, and the pair went racing down the hall, the pigeon squawking all the time. Down the hall with bullets ripping, after bird came old duke tripping, but the lucky pigeon skipping dodged bullets upon the lime, and it seemed they'd been chasing forever, time after time. Both the pigeon, half past nine, the duke entered, drawn and jaded, and greeted feast with food faded. Only cobwebbed crumbs and dusty glass remained where he used to dine. Then onwards passed his usual place, and looked dejected to a space. There lay his corpse, a rotted waste. He glanced forlorn at the time, slyly, slowly, toward a sword. But the clock began to chime, with the pigeon, half past nine. And the chase is never ending. The old duke has been intending to catch that pigeon suspending the eons of boundless time. And on the heath the dark castle stands, death and life intertwine when the clock strikes half past nine.